Hello, my friends. Welcome back. Well, as we come close to the end of another year, it's nice to know that one thing remains the same, and that is the fantastic quality of an Ubuntu-based Linux system called Ubuntu Mate. This continues to be my Linux gold standard, at least for beginners for the last few years. So let's take a look at this. Now, some of you say, yeah, but Toss, this looks so bland. Well, what about this? Or maybe this. Or maybe this. Very nice. All right, so this is uh, this is one way how you can customize Ubuntu Mate. Now, personally, I prefer to have my uh, single panel uh, at the top where I can have all my shortcuts, as you can see there, uh, to the top left. This is my personally my personal favorite uh, default setting. Now keep in mind with Linux, it's customizable. So I, I find it surprising where some of you say, yeah, but this is so plain Jane looking and bland. Change it. Change the freaking thing. It's just a thought. Of course, with Ubuntu Mate, the ability to add shortcuts or applets, this has always been my personal favorite. And Ubuntu Mate or the Mate desktop has the best weather applet. Well, let's take a look at the specs at my computer. It's a Lenovo running release can a release 20.10 Ubuntu Mate. As you can see here, it's a rather Fred Flintstone-ish dual core <laughs> Athlon 2 with a respectable uh, 8 gigs of RAM. Hey, it's 9 years old, but it works. That's the power of Linux, right? I can get this thing resurrected, resurrected and moving. And a quick lick, a quick lick, no, a quick look, not a quick lick. Where's my coffee? Let's look at the Ubuntu Mate guide real quick. Oh my goodness. Yes, I have discovered Linux. Thank you very much. And why users want to switch from Windows, Mac OS. I like this where it says Ubuntu Mate works for you and not the other way around. That's probably exactly why I chose this one. Now, there are other good choices up there, of course, but I like this one. A look at the welcome screen, a very nice touch. At the bottom right, you can see something that's uh, new, I believe. Click Desktop Layout, and you can change the layout, the look of this, with the Mate Tweak Tool. Very nice. All right, we'll keep moving along here. Graphics, the usual, the internet. I guess you could say I'm an internet browser hopper instead of a distro hopper. Uh, instead of this, or, you know, with this, I... I like Google Chrome. It's never let me down. Just my personal preference. So just keep that in mind. Of course, the ubiquitous LibreOffice suite preferences. Lots of choices here. A quick tip here. If you go down to the um, uh, startup applications here, if you want to speed up the boot up process, you can remove startup applications that you like. Uh, like for example, if you are not going to use a printer, you know you can remove the, the the printer on startup application program or welcome or whatever. Just a quick tip there. All right, let's go to this here on the sound and video. Web <coughs> web web webcamoid. Yeah, webcamoid is new. I tested this, yeah, I still prefer GUVC view, just a personal preference. All right, pulse audio volume control application, a solid application to control your and adjust your sound configurations. All right, and let's take a look at what I installed. This is the Cairo dock. Again, just to give this a little bit of a different look, I don't really use docks that much, but hey, it is Linux, so if you want to customize it, new problem. Very nice looking. All right, let's move along here. And the last thing is the control center. Uh, you you've probably have seen this before. Administration, hardware, internet, and network. Look and feel. Personal, again, this is a one place, one spot to make all your changes. I like the, uh, the teal theme. I've always liked teal. I used to drive a Pontiac Grand, P Grand Prix. Man, I cannot talk this morning. It's not a Grand P, it's a Grand Prix. When I lived in Florida, that was teal colored. I definitely need coffee. But overall, 
yeah it's you know what it just works it is it is a simple system uh hats off kudos to the lead developer of this martin wimpress you know i asked him in an interview wow four or five years ago and he actually did this for his wife his wife wanted a simple system to use something that works out of the box and that's why i've often called ubuntu mate the romantic os so martin wimpress thank you for what i believe to be a linux gold standard ubuntu mate version 20.10 i'll have a link for this below in the show notes Check it out, and of course, happy holidays. Arrivederci.